Hey folks, how y'all doing? This is part two of installing my uh, Cape Cod uh, um, anemometer and wind direction, wind speed and wind direction. Uh, it's on uh, sensors and and the and the barometer and all that good stuff. The, tr the traditional style weather stations um, by Cape Cod um, wind and weather, and they also make down easter. All right, here we go, y'all. I got it installed right here that thing is nice of course we don't have any wind um oh yeah we got a little well not enough really about a about a two one and two mile an hour wind right now but that's how i got my wiring like i showed you in my video earlier the anemometer goes to the wind direction, which is kind of neat. Right now it's coming out of the southwest, the wind is. And then I got the cable, the 11 conductor cable plus wind speed. Um, I'll show you that in a second. And here's where I got the cable running into up underneath the eave, drill the hole and put a grommet to protect it from the metal, use the hole saw, and I put some silicone around, I love 100% silicone. Alright, now I'll come in here, I'll show you where I wired it at, but I love these traditional style, these are kind of these on sailboats, they last a long time, and they don't, don't use any power except for the wind direction. Now that uses a little bit of power, um, but the wind speed it runs off its own little wind generator, little gyro. Uh, all right, that's part two. I'll show you when we get some wind how it, how it works. All right, come inside the building. I got the cable. Uh, let me shut this door so you can really see it. All right, I've got the cable coming up right through here. The cable's coming right through there because it's, it's, it's um, um, all the eaves and all the overhang is uh, is breathable. It's got you know where the whole building will breathe. <laughs> and I didn't even mean to pick that little knot right there in the wood, but it just kind of felt, found its way through there. But anyway, I got a staple with the staples they provide. Cape Cod Wind and Weather provided their staples, and I got stapled eh, not every, about every few feet. Um, right there, I got a staple there. A staple there. Uh, staple here and so on then I just got it going through a straight shot a lot of people put them on the outside of the building to the wire but I just ran mine inside and there's more cable wire and so on and it goes up there behind my turkey and goes down that beam that beam right there that beam going down through the building all right, and I'll show you what I got. But yeah, it was an all-day project. I started this morning about 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock this morning I started. But here she is. She is lit up. The wind is out of the southwest. Let's see if you see that southwest. And that's the wind direction. And, it is, and here's a barometer. And here is the wind speed on um, Cape Cod wind. Um, Cape Cod wind and weather indicators, Harwich Port, Cape Cod, Massachusetts, USA. But yeah, I mean, I'm gonna try to. I'm gonna take this thing. This thing was a bear, and it's pretty. wasn't that bad. But as you see, all the wires are color coded. That's what I meant by 11 conductor 
wires red blue gray orange brown uh yellow green blue white the power court court and the black is the common so that goes into the black in the black where the wind indication is too then here's your power and then I got my then the power cord comes down and it goes through them slots right there all right and then here's the wind that's hooked up with two, two leads coming from the gyro from the anemometer and here's my power cord and that's hooked up to the wind indicator but yeah it was it was a job I'm telling you but yeah I really enjoyed it but let me hang this bad boy back up all right but yeah and I just uh I'll put this thing back in this little slot right here yeah it makes it a lot neater but anyway that's that's neat how the points and direction and just it's the old traditional style uh, before they got this old fancy stuff like which I love the fancy stuff don't get me wrong because this this dead logs oops, sorry about that y'all this dead logs the man the sun is bright this dead logs of Davis so it's zero mile an hour wind and it's, it's it's out of the south southwest it's just some dirty wind it's all over the place but that's at a real high peak I got that thing 20 feet up in the air which my other one is 18 my Davis Vantage View and but yeah it's pretty cool and like you said the last gust was two mile an hour but yeah they I love these traditional weather instruments they're nice especially when they work not just for decoration yeah these are nice But yeah, anyway, I picked up another one off eBay, and man, that is awesome. It's wind speed, and tells you mile per hour, and kilo, kilometers per hour. But they're nice instruments. Nice. It's always good to have a spare. <laughs> But here's a the little cards I get with me. Cape Cod Wind and Weather. Y'all look them up, y'all. They're pretty awesome. I'm not a salesman for them, but they're 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 cool. And just wanted to share them. I asked the people um, at Cape Cod if it was alright to make a vi YouTube videos because I really like the products. And simple, simple, uh, simple, awesome. Weather weather systems, T traditional made stuff, and they they've been in business since 1939. But anyway, this is part two of my video, and here's our instructions. It came in a box right here, all my cable uh, instructions, Cape Cod, wind and weather, keeping an eye on the weather since 19 1939. Yeah, so it's great instructions how to mount the wind indicator, the wind speed, and the in wind indicator, and all that good stuff. So yeah, and here's the wind speed indicator. But yeah, it's pretty pretty awesome. But anyway, y'all, I just wanted to share that with you. Now, I'll, I'll do another video on it when we get some wind. And. God, that wind, that stuff is bright. There we go. We got the old thing in the background. Anyway, this is KVSMC uh, on Cape Cod traditional uh, on weather stations. Y'all have a good one. Thank you for watching. Y'all come back. All right. Bye bye.